not talking to get over it. Anyways, my assistant, Andrew, asked me to say a few nice things about the act we do together. And considering I'm pretty much the star of the whole shebang, I gotta admit, I feel a little embarrassed. But what the heck? Here goes nothing. For starters, I guess I should tell you that even though Andrew is the goofiest, the most unpredictable performer I've ever worked with, if you twist my bill, I'd have to admit he's also my favorite. Thank goodness he's not your typical magician. None of this dull agent hippie in a poor fitting tuxedo pulling rabbits out of a hat. Rabbits! Ha! Overrated rodents, if you ask me. Anyways, Andrew doesn't do that stuff. Instead, he does crazy, funny, off-the-wall stuff. Stuff that isn't just magical, but actually fun. Stuff people really remember. The guy's a freak, you know. Crazy for Google Bus. I mean, one moment he's pulling cookies out of thin air, and the next he's actually crawling inside a super huge balloon. I know, I know. Quite the airhead. But I'll give him this much, because everything he does is so visually oriented, we can play pretty much anywhere. And we do. Together, we work everything from large theaters, trade conventions, to cruise ships, in the States, Europe, and South America, you name it. Audiences always like the guy. But like I said, he's a bit of a nutball. Frankly, I think he was dropped a lot as a kid. He's even got a bit of a thing for toilet paper. Guess I'm not the one who needs to be housebroken. And during every show, I always make sure Andrew brings a lot of people up on stage. You know, to get them really involved in the craziness. Even if it means they end up lying all over the stage. One time, Andrew made a woman at a Bell Canada show laugh so hard, she blew jello out of her nose. Strange thing was, she was eating chocolate pudding at the time. <laughs> Folks, try the meal. I'll be here all big. Get it? Big. <laughs> of course, the highlight for me is when I use my kung fu training to find a selected card. People go nuts. Bruce Lee, eat your heart out. Okay, so I'm not a heavyweight. I guess I'm more of a featherweight. Get it? Featherweight! We've had our embarrassing moments. There was that time we lost a bet and had to go on the Jenny Jones show. But I gotta admit, sometimes Andrew even cracks me up. And believe me, I've seen them all, and I know everybody in the business. Streisand, De Niro, you name it. Anyways, I gotta get going. I'm shooting this new film with Stallone, and I gotta be in makeup in 20 minutes. But if you got a show coming up, and you'll want to book the kind of act people will talk about for a long, long time, give Andrew a call, and he'll pass the message on to me. I'm out of here. Later.